Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel. And if you are on Windows 11 and have installed the C band updates, which are the bug fixing updates that are always released uh, later in the month for Windows 11, well, the C band updates for Windows 11 actually have um, done a little something that might be bad for some of you. Apparently, and Microsoft did acknowledge that a certain number of people had a frozen start menu. So you couldn't click the start button. You couldn't uh, even use the, the the Windows key to bring the start button, the start menu and anything. So this is apparently just a small, according to Microsoft, a small amount of people. So uh, they have actually fixed the problem through their known issue rollback. So this is, of course, a new feature that's been uh, there for a little while now, uh, a new feature that enables Microsoft to just trigger a little uh, bit in Windows that tells them, uh, that tells your computer, okay, just roll back that update for now because there's a problem. Now, it doesn't roll back for everybody. The non-rollback issue is only happening on computers that have the problem, which means if you were one of those with the problem, Technically, being online, the computer still is working and receiving data. So apparently a known rollback issue is actually done. So it should kind of fix itself uh, automatically. And so um, what you could do is issue a uh, control alt delete and do a, a restart or a shutdown and restart. Technically, it should fix itself just with that. Uh, so this has been um, three or four times now in the past year that uh, the known rollback um, issue rollback feature has been used in Windows. So this is not bad, but the problem with the known roll issue rollback feature is that it has to be triggered by Microsoft, which means Microsoft must also acknowledge that there is a problem, which is not always the case, and that is the probably the negative side of the uh, rollback issue. So anyways, if you had a problem with your start menu, Microsoft issued the um, command for a rollback for all the Windows 11 PCs affected. And what happens is that if you restart your computer, like I said, Control, Alt, Delete will give you the menu for the restart or the shutdown and restart then of the PC. It should actually come back to normal because it will issue, that command will actually remove the update and all that will be asked is a restart in most cases um, possibly if you really really stuck um, you know a force shutdown by holding the power button for five seconds or more so let's hope that this is fixed um, one of the things that of course is worrisome with a problem like that is it has to be fixed really quickly because the patch tuesday updates are coming up in a couple of weeks and those will want to reinstall that update so I don't know what's going to happen with that. I would guess Microsoft will have a fix by then and things should be back to normal. So uh, yep there was a problem if you uh, restart after installing the patch Tuesday um, optional updates. Um, if your start menu didn't work it's a known issue and it should be fixed now. If you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.